master comes from, you know, like master swipe, grandmaster swipe. Basically, that's takeoff similar to wrap, but instead of bringing the leg with your momentum around you, you kind of keep your knee up and almost get it in the way. The master scoop is the master setup into the scoop. And the leg you normally bring back for your scoop, you're instead going to place in the front. And now when you do this, I take your hands, twist, then twist into putting your first hand down as you would a scoop. And then just hop around and put your other hand down. And see, that's like a very small version of the master scoop. You shouldn't be pushing off so much with this leg. You want to work away from that. You want this leg to be all the jumping. Your twist will get you around. And you want to push off with your hands to get the momentum. You're going to want to try it from standing. Now, instead of doing it from straight up standing where you go like this and lift the leg, that's actually a little bit harder because you don't have the circular momentum into it and you may hurt your wrist. So, you want to start out with either like a hook kick, a wheel kick, or even something creative like the end of a beast with so. And when you're entering the master scoop, you can have your foot facing the way you came. So if you land in hyper, you can have your foot facing that way and that'll give you more of a back handspring kind of access to it. And you can end a little more sideways and that'll give you the ability to look around and then kind of cartwheel into it. From here, crouch a little bit. You don't want to be straight legs. Crouch, throw around, hand down, boom, and then right from there, just like a round ball. Shrug, lift, and now your leg's coming through, set, twist.